Hello everybody and welcome back to Global Swim Your Home Board. Today we are heading up and then back down to Jade, the final moon of the gateway system. We're finally finishing the entire thing. It's been so fucking long. It's been a big ass journey. It's been a long ass journey. But it has been worth it because we've met some, we've explored some beautiful uh, moons of Gateway, and also we have explored the entire the Gateway itself, the Gas Giant. So yeah, that's that's cool. The Gateway. I mean, I'm not saying that I'm I'm, I'm never gonna go there again. Because I probably will. I smack my desk, and the entire camera will like. Blah, blah, blah. So I'm sorry about that. I'm probably gonna visit the uh, Gateway system again because Com is such a beautiful moon, and I'm probably gonna visit it again. So yeah, booster separation it was, and now our only hope to, or only thrust I should say, to orbit is the single member engine. It sounded so bad, it, it, it sounded like I'm saying that the mammoth engine is a little thick. The mammoth engine is the most powerful engine in the game, so that thing is a fucking beast. Yeah, while we're circularizing, circularizing, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell so don't miss any new video launch, which is happening every Tuesday. So, we're circularizing, and let me tell you, one of those kerbals is right now suffering from depressurization, and also it doesn't know what the fuck is going on because she, I believe. Doesn't have any, con any like screen in front of her because she's on an external seat outside of the outside of any command pod. Yeah, that's she. And there's a guy behind her in a cockpit who is having a beautiful warm time. And having a drink of coffee, if you can, if you can drink it, that is. I don't know how coffee drinking works in real gravity. So yeah. But the rover, the rover was a bitch. It doesn't look beautiful. It didn't look beautiful at all. It was, but it was a definitely a fucking bitch. It just wanted to wiggle around like a floppy disk, dick, floppy disk. Here comes my uh, IT school, I, IT specialist school brain, floppy disks. When I was thinking about floppy disks, you come, my brain just censors on its own and becomes a like floppy disk. Good job, brain, you're censoring yourself. That's nice. So, yeah. We said goodbye to Roth and we said hello to Gateway. Now, let's talk about the rover. The rover, as I said, is a bitch. More importantly, it's fucking terrible. Which is more important than being a bitch because Bitches can be, bitches can not, can be, not terrible. This thing was a terrible fucking mistake that I've made. Because it has the worst, possibly, but no, let's not say the worst. It has bad design, because it is so low to the ground, and the lowest point Oh, basically the floor of the entire rover is 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 our fuel tanks, which, as we all know, or if you don't know, the fuck's wrong with here, are fucking explosive. So it was just about time, whenever these things just touch a rock and then just blow the shit out of us, because. Again, fuel tanks are explosive. 
would have known. I didn't. Yeah. yeah. Jade. Jade. Yeah, yeah there we go. Uh, uh, we're we're so circling around Jade already, and I, I wanted to go in an equat at least near an equatorial orbit, mission, so it would be easier to just take off and to maneuver the craft, and I would know where the fuck I am. The transfer stage, the transfer stage is a nuclear stage, but it it is a transfer stage from gateway to road. But I made it so it would be a transfer stage from road to gateway, from gateway to road. But as usual, I overbuilt my rocket. And it, I saved a bunch more, a bunch more fuel than I needed, which is not a concern. But it's not bad to save fuel. So yeah. Here, we're landing on the surface of Jade. I can't see shit because the ground is so fucking white. That's what she said. Pork. I just landed on my porch and flew off. Probably because I'm too low. Yeah. I we landed and then exploded and then landed exploded again. And I said third time is the charm. And part third times the charm it was indeed. We landed. We had everything done. Now I had all the signs taken. And I was just rolling down because I was like, yeah, let's get some signs from the lowlands or plains or whatever the fuck. Because this was the midlands. And while going down, this shit happened. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Oh, there we go. This shit happened. As I said, it was just a matter of time when something hits the fuel tanks and everything just explodes. So, yeah. but thank god I made a quick save and a quick load. And now we're ready to take off and meet the transfer stage. Because, hell no, I'm not staying here anymore because it's boring. This moon was so far one of the most boring moons I have ever visited. It has the amazing color combination of light, gray, dark gray, and everything in between. And it's also pretty damn like a white. I mean, yeah, it was. Also, I didn't see any interesting train scatterers on it either. Like, we have seen fucking ships or hologram rocks but here there is fucking nothing yeah, batteries fucking finish good job Bad. I hope it's gonna take a few more minutes so I can finish this one. so here we are trying to find trying to encounter I should say our transfer stage and keep on fucking forgetting I keep on trying to say it's a descent stage, not a fucking descent stage, it's a transfer stage. What am I fucking talking about? Where the fuck is my brain going? Yeah. yeah. Whatever. So, here it is. We are docked. I have hiccups and also burps. Have you ever burped and then hic got hiccups in the same time? And also, on top of that, you had to cough? That's how you deflate your lungs. Yeah, yeah. It happened to me a few times. And it was like people were like next to me like my fuck is so sad. I was like I think I just died so god and then came back. Yeah. We say goodbye to Jade. I'm probably not gonna come here too often. It's a boring one. This was the plan. To leave the rover in orbit or make it crash into the ground and then I just can take off and go to the road. But 
I forgot that there was another curve, and I was like, oh, oh shit, there's nowhere else I can put it, put him for. So then I, th I thought about, let's get the seat and strap it on the side of the rocket, and I was like, gosh, that doesn't gonna work because I don't have an engineer. And apparently scientists and pilots are dumb and they don't know shit about just putting strands, things together. Yeah. We said goodbye to Gateway and we said Hyde Road already. And we're about to... About? About? The fuck? And we're about... About. We're about to circularize. Why the fuck this word sounded so raw? Yet so right at the same time. I don't know. I don't know. I actually don't know. Yeah, here we are. Already circle rised, and I'm just gonna lower my periapsis a bit. Just so I can barely touch around it. But. And then I got an encounter with Lua because. That was necessary. I messed up my perapsis a few million times, as you can see. Yeah, finally I got there. And time for deceleration and lowering my apolapsis. Isn't that fun? Seeing everything just go together. So, yeah. And we have achieved. Circular orbit, the fuck? There's a fucking door. What's happening today? And it came time to re enter with this thing, and I was like, I'm not sure how it's everything's gonna happen, but I may or may not survive. I may or may not just. Die in a fireball. Let's start spinning. Because that is, seems to work. I got some temperature gauges. And I definitely didn't explode a thing. I don't know how the fuck did that happen. But I didn't explode a single thing. But of course, we had no parachute. And I was like, let's leave this thing out and just splash down with our kerbal. Because they have parachutes. Convenient. And since we recovered her from the ocean, she had just a little bit of swim after a long, long journey of going to Gateway and back. So, yeah. And now we're recovering our our other turbonaut, and he's gonna splash down with her with with crew parachutes. And we bring them all back together, and that's the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please don't forget to subscribe if you're new. And as always, I hope to see you next week. Until then, have an awesome week.